and welcome to the 2016 Duck Hook Knockout Draw. We are here at the lovely Rand Park and we're set up and ready to go to do this 32 man knockout draw to find out who is going to be the best match play player of 2016. Andrew Nielsen holds the title, who he beat the man next to me at Wingate Park in 2015. Francois? Well, thanks for that, Maz. Yeah, well, Andy is one of the best match play players out there on the Duck Hook Tour. Definitely. Um, he did deserve the win. Um, but there will be quite a few new contenders this year trying to steal the, the, the title from him. We have 32 players divided into three parts. Part 1 will be the Sunday League players. Part 2 will be a mixture between Thursday League and Sunday League players. Part 3 will be for the Thursday League players alone, which is also the biggest pot and there's 14 contenders in there. So how will all work? We have the left hand side of the draw and the right hand side of the draw. The left hand side of the draw will be the Sunday League players. The right hand side of the draw will be the Thursday League players. And then part two, which is a mixture who can play in both, will be allocated alternatively. Shall we get it underway? You go first. Why not? One. On Sunday League. The 2015 Thursday League champion, Werner Pretorius. Werner Pretorius will be coming up against the man next to me, who won at Royal East earlier in February. There's your first matchup, that wasn't too hard. Thursday League, going to the right side of the draw. The first person drawn is Gavin Pop Up Carter. <laughs> and he will be playing against, ooh, all the way from the UK, just to take part in the Duck Hook Tour, Peter Langrish Smith. Good luck, Gavin. Next up on the Sunday side of the draw is Boris Barnard, who applies his trade in the Sunday League and he's had a couple of top three finishes has, this year as he's well. He's been playing very well. He came third at Irene in the last Sunday League. Right, then against Baddies is Sean Salmon, our latest Thursday League winner at ERPM. Baddies versus Sean. Kevin Ho, currently third on our Thursday League rankings. Yeah, he'll be taking on... He will be taking on the man next to me, Maz. Sunday League Okay, next on, Sunday League pot. Ooh, ooh. Ryan Jensen. Can't get enough duck hook, apparently. No, he, plays he plays Thursday, heavily. Thursday, Sunday. Right. Then we have Ryan Esmond. Thursday League side. Here we go. And it is Werner Baumeister. Officially holds the record for the most second place finishes. Absolutely. Again at the RPM. And he will be taking on Andre Reichel, one of the veterans from, from Duck Hook. He's also got a major under his belt, the Summer Cup from 2014. Jock Stradom, second ranked player on the Sunday League leaderboard of the five events. Well then, Jock, and you'll be taking on Johan Meyer, who reached the quarterfinals last year in the knockout. Go back to this side. Thursday, it is Andre Kotzer, the leader of the Thursday League. He's going to be taking on. He'll be playing against one of the seniors, Tony Borragero, taking part in his first knockout. Going back to the left side of the draw, Jaku Groblar. He leads the way in the Sunday League leaderboard, um, playing all the events, and yeah. He's doing well. He's due one. He's going to get one soon. He's going to be playing against brother of Ryan Jensen, Wayne Jensen, who's also a newcomer to the tour. Jaku versus Wayne Jensen. Thursday side of the draw. Paul Scumby will be hoping to get past the first round this year. And he will be playing against Andrew Nielsen, the mm. defending champion. I reckon Scumby might just be knocked out in the first round again. Might just, I think so. Mm. And then back to the left side. And the last of the Sunday League players, Alistair Sinclair. He'll be taking off Rudolf van der Berg, or Plummer as many know him, who won this year on the Sunday League at Broncos Spreit. Right, so all we have left is a few Thursday League players and they will all be playing against each other. So we're just going to draw these to fill out the rest of the spots. We have Willem Kruger featuring in the top 10 of the Thursday League. And he will be taking on Eddie Ivans, another senior on tour. Right, then Andre Milan Jr. who's our most recent Sunday League winner. You will be taking on... Might be his dad. Let's see. Dad. He's taking on... Liedem Versilino, two-time major winner, one of the better players on the Duck Hook event calendar. Ren. Smitty Siankamp, who also reached the quarterfinals last season. He will be taking on... He will be taking on Mark Borregero, 
two-time Thursday League winner. Mm -hmm. Might be a tough contest there. Right, then we have Jason Ivings, our latest major winner. He will be taking on... Heinrich Boetes, one of the new guys from, from Dakuk. Um, yeah, taking part in his first knockout as well. And the final matchup of the 2016 first round of the Dakuk knockout is Andre Milan Sr., father and biggest fan of Andre Milan Jr. <laughs> he will be taking on one of the Dakuk veterans on the Thursday and Sunday league, Anton Bauer. Oh, there we go. So there it is, all exciting, 32 guys in the draw. When does it happen? The first one is the Sunday League on the 12th of June at Centurion, that's 10 days from now. And the next one will be the Thursday League on the 30th of June at Danesburg. Perfect, and don't forget, all the matches will be on live scoring, so you can sit in your office, watch all the live action in the comfort of your own chair. And if you have not joined the Duck community, email this link below. Get involved. Thanks very much, we'll see you soon. See you. Oh,